Hello everyone! Today I'm going to show you how to get multiplayer working on Melon DS, primarily multiplayer for the Pokemon games for the Nintendo DS. Once it's downloaded, open up the Melon DS folder that you create and put the files into by double clicking on the folder. Make sure you have a ROMs folder with ROMs games in it. I can't tell you where to get them because I own all of mine. Next up, we're going to open up Melon DS by clicking on the Melon DS application file. Config and input and hotkeys. Make sure that the joystick at the very bottom is set to whatever controller or keyboard slash mouse you are using. And then map the keys and hit OK. Next up, we're going to click on System, go down to Multiplayer, and Launch New Instance. You're going to need two of Melon DS open so that you can do the multiplayer. And then on the second instance of Melon DS that you just opened, open up controller slash hockey config and map the controls to the second window as well using a different controller or keyboard. Then hit OK. And then open up both ROMs on both windows of Melon DS. This is very important because you're going to pretend that you have two Nintendo DS's open and within proximity to each other to activate the multiplayer on the wireless function via the Melon DS emulator. Once your game is loaded, head over to the Pokemon Wireless Club Union Room and enter a room. If done correctly, both instances and characters from both Melon DS windows should show up, allowing you to battle and trade. We're going to showcase trading first and then a battle. Enjoy the show!
See everyone? That is how you do multiplayer and trading and battling with Pokemon on Melon DS. And this works the same for all other multiplayer DS games. Ridge Racer, Nintendogs, anything you can think of, you do it via this method. Thank you for watching, and I hope you like, share, and subscribe.